Hi, I am Abby Clotario and today I would like to share with you a quick fix on an issue that I encountered with the Vocal Line Project 5. Okay, so let's dive in. So I recently purchased the Vocal Line Project 5 for this project that I've been working on. For those of you who are not familiar, the Vocal Line Project 5 is a plugin. It's a syncing tool, okay? It's a plugin that lets you sync your audio tracks, okay? So kind of cool find, right? Anyway, so I installed it, okay? I'm running it on my Windows 10 and with my DAW Studio One and actually it didn't work. I couldn't find it. The Studio One cannot find it. I tried to scan it, okay, with my plugin scanner. Okay, right here. I even tried to, okay, let's try it again, just to check. But, okay, after I scanned it and searched for it, it couldn't find it there. So you're supposed to see it when you search it on your effects folder, but it's not there. And you can also actually uh, see it here in the audio tab, okay? But as you can see, there's no edit with Vocaline project. So I tried to look for solutions on the website and some of the fixes that were suggested were one, update Studio One. Actually, I updated it. It's 5.4.1. So now that didn't work. It said also refresh the plugin list or folder, which we just did right now, didn't work. And yeah, of course, I tried to uh, submit a ticket uh, with their customer support and I'm actually still waiting for their email. Okay, so I tried my best, but I think my best wasn't good enough. <laughs> so I tried again and again and I tried to search on the folder of my plugins just to check if I really installed it correctly. So upon installing it, okay, it's, it's here the program files common files vst3 there it's there right so hmm okay there is a quick fix ladies and gentlemen but before that thank you for watching this video <laughs> and i hope please if you haven't yet please subscribe on my channel abby glutario and click on the notification bell for the new videos that comes up every now and then okay so back to the issue <laughs> so my vocal line project 5 is properly installed but i saw something and the folder has an extension name i don't know why but there's a dot vst3 on it so what i did was to rename it i just tried it okay remove the extension name all right so it just says now vocal line project 5 and just to be safe, I am going to restart my DAW and uh, so that the plugin uh, scanner can search for all of the plugins again. So I'll see you in a bit. I'll just restart. Okay, so my studio one restarted, so I'm going to reopen the file and I'm going to search for the plugin again. Hopefully, it's usable now. <laughs> okay, let's see. I'll go to the effects tab, search for it, vocal line. And voila, it's there. All right, so all you have to do is drag and drop this to whatever track you need it to be, like so. And it will appear like that. Woohoo! Okay. And as I've said, you can also use it here. Let me just, okay, open, all right, click on an audio track that you need to sync. And if you go to the audio tab, you will see their audit, on oh, no, audit, edit with vocal line or remove vocal line, whatever you need to be. And it's working. I can see it already. I'm excited to do my project now. <laughs>
okay i'll probably do a tutorial a separate tutorial for the vocal line project 5 but for now i hope this solution worked for you too if it did please tell me in the comments and so that i know that i was able to help you so i will see you on my next video i hope you learned something today guys please subscribe abigatorio bye